My paper's folded. Why am I folding the paper, Logan? Because you're not showing the numbers. That's how Keeping you control. Keep control. Uh, yeah. And, and let, 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 me, let me explain something about control. Do I want to control the person? No. 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 If I try to control you, Brent, what's your natural response? Fight you. F fight me. Push back. Defense. Okay? Blow out. But I should control the process. Okay? I used to get, I used to, my sales managers used to yell at me, go get in control of that son of a bitch, Richards. Well, chances are the guy that, I, or the, the person I was trying to control probably was twice as old as I was and made ten times the money I did. Okay? And it was a dumb idea anyway. But it was part of the automotive culture. We don't control people. We should control our process. It's pretty much a home game every time. Okay, unless you're, unless you're taking a vehicle out to someone's place of business or their home, it's a home game. Um, Chris hasn't bought a car in five years. I've probably talked to a thousand people since the last time he bought a car. Should he be better at buying than I am at selling? No. No, yet I see, peop I see salespeople outsold every single day by consumers. Because make no mistake about this, a sale takes place every time a customer walks on the lot. Either they sell you on not buying or you sell them on buying. But we're really not selling them, are we, Brent? What are we doing? Yeah, helping them make an informed decision. Helping them buy a car or a truck. All right, so Chris, thanks for your patience. Um, you picked out one gorgeous Ford F-150. Uh, first choice of color, correct? All right, equipped just the way you said it had to be equipped. Please don't forget. You're not going to have any automobile or truck repairs on this for three years of 36,000 miles because you've got a comprehensive Ford warranty. Okay, then you've got a five-year, 60,000-mile powertrain warranty. You've got a five, is it five years roadside assistance? Mm -hmm. You've got five years, 60,000 60, miles of roadside assistance. All right. Um, you've also got a 72-hour exchange opportunity. I believe this is the right truck. You believe it's the right truck. But if in the first three days it turns out it's not the right truck, what did I tell you you could do? It Bring it all back and we'll exchange it for another one. And the best thing of all is, first of all, the internet price brought you here, right? Okay, well, I'm going to guarantee that price is going to be the best price on an F-150 like that in the United States of America. I'll throw in Canada and Mexico as well. Okay? Um, shoot, while we're at it, let's throw in the continent of South America. You've got a best value guarantee. You got five days to search for the same truck. You know you can find the same truck at an, any number of Ford stores. And if it's advertised for a lower price with the same benefits we offer, what did I tell you we'd do? Check. Cut your check back for the difference. Here's your opportunity. There is a discount of $7,500. Okay? That's the MSRP. Then you've got a Ford rebate of $6,750. That is over $4,000. $15,000 of discounts. Okay, your vehicle, we love it. We'll buy it for $16,000. But you know what? We're not going to stop there at $16,000 because what we're going to do is three, we're going to provide you a tax savings of $480 because you're trading it to us. That's um, thanks to the state of North Carolina. But it's real money. Chris, if you actually decided not to trade your truck, our price would literally go up by 480 bucks. Not because we change it, but because the taxes would change. Okay? After your taxes and fees, there's your balance. Over here, we're going to give you choices. Um, cash down, two, three, four thousand. By the way, you don't need to stop at four. Why would I ask you for cash down? Well, you tell me. Do you like lower payments? more cash you put down, the lower the payment. Do you like to save money? I do. The smaller the balance to finance, whether you borrow the money from Ford Motor Credit or Aunt Millie, the fewer the finance charges you pay. Number three, you'll have the option to do something uh, most people don't, and that's shorten the term. Guess what happens when you shorten the term? You save money again. Smaller balance, shorter term, fewer finance charges. When you've got a smaller balance and a shorter term, you are going to build equity faster in the vehicle, which gives you the opportunity to trade sooner, if you so desire. And lastly, 
you get to the dream payment way faster. You know what the dream payment is, don't you? That's zero. That's no payment at all. So taking that into consideration, which one of these cash down numbers makes the most sense to you, or like I say, you can go higher if you want. Well, Steve, uh, before we even get over there, sure. Uh, I'm kind of concerned right there with the price. I mean, I, I think we're close, but uh, I'm going to need you to sharpen that pencil a little bit. I mean, I, like you want a bigger discount than $14,000, right? Yeah, I, I do. Okay. I think that's funny, um, and you're not going to get it. All right.